Good morning guys and welcome to Vlogmas Day 5. breakfast and I know I showed you guys that I had oatmeal for the past two days and you guys are probably in order some breakfast but today I'm actually having a little bit something different I'm having an avocado toast like lately I've been having like a lazy breakfast but that's what I crave so that's what I'm having um let me get my bread. and if you guys are wondering this is the bread that I use this is the low carb flaxseed because I get questions on what bread I use so I'm just going to prepare my toast and I kind of wanted to talk a little bit about something. By the way, you're going to see me a lot without makeup in these vlogs because I don't wear too much makeup. Today is Saturday so I might do my makeup later on today. Depends on what I'm doing but usually I don't really do my makeup that often. Alright guys, so my toast is ready and here she is. I just added avocado, my two egg whites. Everything but the bagel seasoning from Trader Joe's and tapatio because it's so bomb. And I kind of wanted to talk to you guys a little bit, kind of have like a mukbang. Um, I wanted to talk about how much it sucks that the gym closed and a lot of us were working in some goal, whether it was to gain uh, muscle or to lose weight or whatever the case may be. It sucks because, like, for example, me, I feel like I, I haven't weighed myself, but I feel like I have lost weight, especially in my lower body that's where I lose weight first everybody loses weight from different places and me unfortunately is my lower body and that sucks because a lot of girls I'm sure they rather have a, a bigger lower body than upper body that's just how my body is and that's just where I lose weight from first and, and what takes me longer to build so it sucks but yes I have equipment um, at home I have gym equipment at home that I can use but it's not the same as going to the gym and using the all the equipment they have. Obviously, they have way more equipment than I do. And I can go to my max there. Here at home, yes, I have some weights. But in order to build muscle or to build a booty or whatever it is, you need to be lifting heavy and eating enough. Like I said, I've been sick. I haven't been eating great. I, I, I feel like I've been under eating a little bit. And, and I feel like um, I lost a lot of my muscle mass that I had on my legs I feel like they're they're like thinner now and obviously my booty I was building it I'm not telling you that I had a great um behind but I was working on it and I was seeing some progress but ever since they closed the gym I think it's been like a month I haven't been consistent and I've been working out at home but not as often and I do see a difference it really sucks but I mean, there's nothing else we can do but try and work with what we have. If you're trying to lose weight, you can still go run. You can do home workouts like HIIT workouts. I don't think it's going to affect as much as for those that are trying to build a body. And, you know, a lot of people do lose muscle because that's the first thing you're going to lose. And then you lose fat. So, that's my story. I just kind of wanted to vent. I know a lot of you guys can relate. If your gyms are open, please take advantage. My gym's closed. There are some that are open like outdoors, but I don't feel like... I don't even want to try it because I know it's going to be packed. There's like a limited amount of gyms open here and I don't want to be risking it. So right now I'm going to stick to working out at home while they open my gym. And probably going hiking or running just to, to keep a good um, heart health. It's super important. So if you can relate, please leave it in the comments. You are not alone. Um, once they open up again, I'm going to start again to try and build my strength. Right now I feel weaker. I don't feel like I can lift as heavy. But I'm so ready to go back. And meanwhile, let's not give up. Let's continue working at home. Let's work with what we have. Be consistent with your eating. And eat good to feel good. And love yourself at whatever stage we're in. I know that's a really big challenge. But I feel like, I feel like that's something we all have to do and learn how to do. To love ourselves at our worst and at our best. And don't be so hard on ourselves because right now we're going through a pandemic that if we're even alive and healthy, that's already, we're already winning. There's a lot of people that are not as close to how we are. There's a lot of people that are suffering, that lost family members. And right now I think we should just focus on being happy and healthy and work with what we have instead of complaining about things we don't have just wanted to get that out of my chest and i just wanted to talk okay i'm gonna start eating now because it was supposed to be a mukbang mm. salud i also hope you guys are enjoying vlogmas my life is not super interesting but i like vlogging i just don't have a lot of time to do it these past days because i was off of work i was sick I, I really enjoy it and i hope you guys are enjoying it too and please let me know if you are enjoying them 
I'm gonna be adding different videos like for different things um, but I'm gonna try to upload something every day so I'm just gonna finish my food and then I'll just catch you guys later okay guys so I'm about to try an experiment I saw something on TikTok I think it's called stripping clothes or stripping clothing something like that so it's supposed to um, really deep clean your clothing right now I'm gonna try it with whites as you can see this is not white for example this sports bra if you can see it's like it's like not even white I don't know it's like a really ugly white also I'm gonna really put this to test because like look at this hat and the camera looks clean but it is not definitely not clean so I'm gonna do this one look at this nasty it's supposed to be white and this one I'm pretty sure you're gonna be able to tell but look how dirty this is so let's see if this works I'm gonna see if we can save these hats I'm gonna start with only these okay guys. so I just put in two because not everything fit I'm filled with really hot water so here are the ingredients that I bought this is not part of it so we're supposed to use powder tide um, baking soda and borax and also I think they said oxyclean but I didn't find any so I'm gonna just try with these three hopefully it works since it's just a little bit, I'm not going to add a bunch. Um, I will show you guys how much I have. I'm going to start with the Tide. I haven't really used powder soap in a very long time. So, right, it should be one fourth. That's a lot. Okay, I think that's good. And by the way, I found this one at Walmart. You can find everything at Walmart. So, I'm going to use just the dash. Okay. I'm supposed to like move it with a stick. Actually, I'm just gonna do it with the mop. Kind of. Oh my god, I already see a lot of dirt coming out. Do you guys see that? Wow. I'm gonna let it sit for a couple of hours, maybe all day, and then I'll show you guys the results. Wow, this is crazy. Hi friends, I haven't vlogged all day because I'm cleaning my closet and I'm so proud of myself because I got rid of I'm getting rid of a lot of clothes and that bag is full of clothes that I'm getting rid of and then I have another one there that I'm giving my little sister away but it's been stressful because I've been trying to clean and I've been doing this for like the past four hours I'm really hungry and I found this man making me sushi I look so bomb Did you make it healthy for me? Okay. My favorite food ever Okay. I know it seems like I eat sushi every day, but I don't, guys. Wow, I gotta show you guys. And FYI, guys, he makes all the sauces from scratch. Mis palos? Look who I came to visit! Precious! Precious! Ojitos? Ojitos, ah, qué hermosa. My sister's chocolate, hot chocolate station. That's cute. She loves me like she comes all the way over here to look for me. Or she's probably looking for food. Excuse me. Have kids, I said. It'll be fun. It'll be fun, they said. Dale, eh. Oh, she, she says, eh, 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 eh. Don't say, eh, eh. <laughs> hey guys so it is the next day i kind of wanted to end the vlog here um so i hope you guys enjoy this vlog i know it was kind of all over the place but yeah if you are wondering i am feeling so much better and i feel almost 100 percent, which i'm really happy because i have to go to work tomorrow so yes thank you so much for joining me in this vlog i hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you guys in the next vlog please if you like this video give it a thumbs up and subscribe and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss any of my videos so i will see you in the next vlog bye